a very warm welcome viewers welcome to business notice and at present i am with kaushik guha dr kaushik guha who is the associate professor and head in the department of electronics and communication engineering national institute of technology silchar sir welcome to business notice we are pleasure to have you on our show so sir, i would like to ask you today we are present in uh, jagi road college so where we are having the workshop related to semiconductor uh, ecosystem so sir, what do you have to say about it and what is the gist of this uh, workshop yeah. yeah because the semi semiconductor actually is nowadays is a booming and vlsi technologies and india is putting a lot of investment and drives to Uh, become the india as a global hub of the semiconductor so this should have happened long time ago but it could not be some reason but now the government has taken his actually focus and everybody is involved so as a becoming a part of institute of national importance in nit silchar uh, i feel that that should be and this is the right time to become a, to make the india as a global hub of the semiconductor because india has the all kind of pool the talents like that so why can india only bring and export and import the semiconductor materials from outside india why cannot india can make its own chips so this is the right time and in this perspective this workshop is very much important to create the awareness in the jaki road college i feel very privileged to come here and to be part of that also sir notice uh, notice in region this is going to be the very first time to witness yeah. uh, something like this so what uh, how is it going to benefit the notice in region yeah obviously because notice in region uh now is uh, drawing a much more attention from to the government of india and they are also thinking to uh, make this region more growing and growing so in that perspective the tata has come to here to set up one semiconductor technology plant and this will immensely benefit all the young generation researchers and everybody so it is not only likely to help the only the vlsi or engineering people so it will also help to get the job for other common students also not in kind of engineering domain but some other domain so when something opens up in a big volume there are some by products that will also open which can be beneficial for the arts commerce or general science people also so for the assam and for entire northeast for the skilled generation for the young generation this semiconductor plant which is coming to in 2 3 years that will be a dream come true and also what kind of job opportunities will it create so can you yeah. tell us the so job opportunity if i am very specific in the domain so maybe there are will be semiconductor technologist mm. and as a vlsi engineer in vlsi is a broad domain like that in the vlsi the students can get their skill set in different parts like they can be a uh, structural engineer the the vlsi student can be process engineer control engineer design engineer or the fabrication process flow technologist okay so several there are but a n number of scopes will open for the engineering people only and so that's why we have to revise our curriculum all the institutions not in idc cultures and everybody is doing so to make the syllabus aligned in such a way so that our students after passing out or four years to three years they will be getting ready to be absorbed by this type of semiconductor industries what are the challenges that will be faced uh, yes. uh, in northeast and region like the students what kind of challenges they they will be facing actually the challenge if you come uh, say that it is for north northeast in entire india one gap is there that is we have already discussed in the panel discussion that is the industry and academia gap so once the moment the gap is becoming closer then it will create a more opportunity so first task to make a good collaboration good liaison with the industries industries and academia should work together this is number one this is for not only northeastern all the part specifically for the northeastern part the challenge is when the connectivity is one kind of thing so nowadays people are also government is doing lots of improvement in the connectivity so connectivity was earlier challenge but now not a challenge every part of the northeast india is connected now with the mainstream then secondly we can say the skilled workforce also the lots of national institute of technology like iip guwahati national importance okay all these institutes are providing and generating large number of skill sets so now these are not being a so challenge after 2 3 years i think we can overcome this type of challenges so geographical location was a challenge but now it is slowly slowly we are moving it will not become a challenge now and skill manpower the talent pool everything is now is available
So is your organization uh, will going to be a part uh, in this initiative and if yes, how is it going to be a part? Yes, obviously because NIT Silchar is being a part of uh, history of national importance and uh, it is also one of the government body of the government of India. So we have been part. So we have by default we are a part of that. So it is already we are in the race. Okay. And how means uh, that we are also training our students okay to become the industry ready so that you can be absorbed in the this type of semiconductor opportunities the technologies and industries and we are revising the curriculum in such a way so that the students are getting much more focus and knowledge on the semiconductor itself because in the son of soil as if assam is getting some kind of opportunity why the students from assam will not get the job so this is our first objective we are training the student in such a way we are getting a help from our ministry and our authority our administration everybody is giving his focus their focus on to improve and how to train the students in such a way so that they can be a as a group and working as an engineer in this type of semiconductor technology hub thank you okay thank you so much sir we had an amazing business conversation today thank you that's all for today keep watching business notice